Welcome to Kaizen House. My name is Elizabeth and today I'm making something special for Chinese New Year. It's the year of the pig, so we're going to be making some red braised pork belly, hong shao ru, excuse my pronunciation. It's one of my favourite dishes because it's quick, easy, super warming. But what's one of your favourite dishes to have for Chinese New Year? To start us off, we've got some pork belly without the skin on. Bone in because we're going to use these ribs in the dish too because I love the flavour of the bones and I think it gives a bit more flavour depth too. So I'm just going to remove the bones just by running my butcher's knife down the bones and away from the meat, but watch out for your fingers. If the belly has very thick skin left on it, remove it, again running your butcher's knife through it. You want to do this before you're portioning the meat, uh, but still put the skin into the pan to enhance the flavour of the dish. Cut up the pork ribs into portions and cut the belly into small chunks ready to braise. Don't forget to cut up that pork belly into small chunks. Uh, you want about bite-sized pieces and get it in the pan with the ribs. I brought a large pan of water to the boil to blanch the meat. This means we'll remove any impurities on the meat that would obscure the flavour of the dish. Boil the meat until you see the impurities come to the top and then drain it and rinse the meat well. Using a clean pan, place some of the oil into the pan and heat it up. Slice some ginger. Crush the white part of the spring onion. Garlic clove. Add some cinnamon sticks, star onions and place it into the oil to release that flavour. And then add in the pork. Stir it really well to coat all those flavours around the pork. Add the shells and rice wine, dark and light soy sauce, and also some pork stock or water. Add the rock sugar into the pan and leave to simmer covered away for an hour, stirring it every now and then. I'm just going to touch more water there because it needed a little bit extra liquid there to braise the meat. And then just cover that and let that simmer away. So this dish has been simmering away for nearly an hour and a half. You can see the meat is now turned into this lovely red colour from the braised liquor. The dish is pretty much finished now, the meat is falling apart nicely, um, but I like it quite sticky and caramelised and rich, so I'm just going to leave this to reduce a bit further until it's just completely caramelised. I'll finish this dish by chopping up some Chinese chives and add it to the dish. So it's some freshly steamed rice and enjoy! If you like this video, please hit subscribe and leave a comment. Have a happy new year. Gong Hai Fat Choi.